Good evening all, Dom here from Essential RC. Thanks for tuning in for our Saturday, regular Saturday night, Saturday evening session on Microsoft Flight Simulator. Hopefully have a few other virtual aviators joining us. We enjoy doing this. It's quite a bit of fun. Great simulator this, when it works properly. It has had its problems recently. So I'm on the tarmac, my Air Mackie MB339 there waiting to start up in the Fricket Tricimori scheme as used by the Italian display team. So uh, for those who haven't and may be interested in joining in and have Microsoft Flight Simulator you'll see there's a link to a Discord group at the top of the live stream chat. Click on that, join the group and you get the benefit of live audio not the delayed live audio that you get uh, via the YouTube live stream and also lots of uh, experience in that group that could be shared with you advice and if you've got problems we can help you solve them <coughs> so I hope that sound is good Let's uh, let's get this started up. Using the engine RPM building. Temperatures coming up. Plays up. Oh, 
because we've got the red canopy light here because we need to lock the canopy. <coughs> easily forgotten and the other thing that we do often forget is that when you do a cold start your air brake is down and that needs to be retracted so we're ready to go let's go to the discord see who we've got with us good evening all good evening so that would be jason yep good to have Hello. you with us jason yeah, it's, it feels like it's been a while, but there's been so many issues recently, but the little hotfix seems to have uh, done me wonders. Ah, yes, I did load that about an hour ago. Are you streaming on the Inertia RC Twitch channel? I am indeed. Excellent. Welcome to uh, viewers on Twitch as well. If you prefer to watch it on Twitch, then, and from Jason's perspective, then uh, join the Inertia RC Twitch channel. Also got uh, Amarok, Chris. Greetings. Hi, Chris. Jamaica Gamer. Uh, Paul is Papa Delta Bravo. We've got Triple with us as well. How are you doing? Hello, gentlemen. Good evening. And hello to Toby G. Right, all right, let's get to the runway. So got much flying in recently, Dom? Uh, yeah, a fair bit. But, uh, I tell you the one the thing I, that I've enjoyed the most, although I've flown my jets and everything like that, I got sent an ornithopter, an eagle ornithopter, to oh, uh, yeah, try cool. out, and it's absolutely fantastic. Sweet. And for those who don't know, an ornithopter is a kind of a, an RC thing that flaps its wings like a bird. So, uh, but it's, it really Incredible. works really, really well. Amazing. Yeah. I've been flying the new one. Somebody posted uh, the ultralight. It's kind of like a hang glider with wheels and an engine. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I saw that flying. picture. Yeah. Is that good? It's, <laughs> yeah, it's actually kind of fun, even particularly around uh, where we are here in Monument Valley. It's, uh, it's neat to fly it at uh, sunset. I'll have to look into that. Uh, I had a loss of my HP 18 today. I saw that. Sorry, mate. Yeah. Condoms. Ah, it's gotten. But it, it does look, it would appear that it is repairable. Um, it's old school. It, I think it in some ways did more damage to the ground than the glider. Um, Why? Being what, what happened? What happened? Um, so it's an old Pat Teakle model. And they use two blade spars, which I've always been like, I don't like the idea of twin spars. I prefer to have one big spar. And when I went through some pretty gnarly turbulence today, it folded a wing. And when I've had a look at it, and you can see on the picture that I took closer up at the top, it's um, that sort of central collector which holds the two spars in has been punched down and folded up, which then folded the wing. Um, and yeah, so that, that's what caused it, I believe. So if I manage to get it repaired, it will be a modification for a single spar and potentially servos in the wings because I don't like the big long snakes and single servo for both ailerons. Oh, well, bad luck, old chap. It's, uh, yeah. Oh they, all end up, they all end up in a bin bag eventually. Yeah, that's it. <coughs> Unfortunately. Right, I okay. saw that. Oh, did. Alan. Hey, John. How you doing? Yeah, good, thanks. I thought you'd all gone. I've taken off. <laughs> no. Nope, still it. <laughs> it's just hit o'clock. It's all right, well, uh, you can catch us up. All right, then, folks. It's uh, on the hour. Do you want to lead, um, Jason? Sure, why not? I'll do it. go for a short field takeoff. So flap set to full. Brakes are on. Check. Power coming up now. Check. Wait for the engines to ramp up. Okay, release and brake in three, two, one, release. Uh, 
100 knots. Gonna go push a bit further. Go right to the end of the runway and rotate. Gear away. Flight turn right, flaps one, flaps zero. Coming back down to half full. Descending. And leveling out. We can see planes tonight, not just name tag. Yeah, there's been so many issues. Something's obviously happened, they fixed something. So I think it was that little 129 meg update by the look of it. Little fix. Yeah. I, I think I'm seeing some VR related weirdness, but it is what it is. You are now. Yeah, I'm just getting it. Well, it's actually it's starting to clear up a bit, but I'm getting some like uh, polka dotting effect in shadow, especially. Nothing too severe, though. It, it does seem to go away. But I did clear the rolling crash, so it could be something to do with that as well. Round to the right. Okay, I'm going to come up to three quarter throttle because I'm just sitting below 200 knots. Going through the gap here and aiming for the thread of the needle gap. I'm going to aim for the small gap on the left hand side. Well, I suppose it's technically the middle gap. I'm going to knife edge through it. Onto the knife and round to the right. Descending as well. We come to the right hand side of this first structure, do a full loop around it to sort of make like a figure of eight off to the monument to the right of it. Do a bit of a uh, chicane past the one after that one as well. So come around left hand side. Pull them back, stick as close as I can. All the way around. Coming over oh. to the left hand side of the next monument. I started off cold and dark on the tarmac, and so I'm catching up to you guys, but I've got weird uh, rudder pedal action happening. Round to the right. Weird rudder pedal action. Yeah, like I'm I'm in VR looking down at the rudder pedals and they twitch totally on their own when I'm not moving everything with the sticks. Yeah. And to the right of the next one, and then hooking it round it all the way to the left hand side. I'm running straight at the next monument for the moment. The North East SPV over to our right there as well. Oh, Simon, yeah. He only ever flies off the beach. Um, he posts this almost every day. I'm very jealous. <clears throat> okay, you're going to run straight up to the monument, go vertical, invert over the top, send, and then turn back up right. So, going up. Rotating over. Sending off the other side. And rotating back over. And then we're going to look left at it. Come to the right hand side of the big monument here. Okay, 
rotating left. Go left hand side of this little one. Now we're going to rotate back right. Let's thread the needle again and then turn immediately left. All the way around, outside of the first monument, inside of it afterwards. And then back round to the right again. Leveling out. Descending. Left hook around the mound towards the monument. Start aiming towards the strip, but we're going to do a loop. Roger. Roger. Carrying on. Right. Right there. We're going to start a left hand turn, nice and smooth. We'll push up the power a little bit more to three quarters, so I'm not going too fast for the A's. Right, Jake. Jake's just watching. Descending. Leveling out. Getting ready to initiate the loop. In three, two, one. Pulling back. Nice big long loop at the top tight, end tight, so we tight. can get all the way over. Throttle to idle in three, two, one, idle. All the way over. Coming back on a throttle now halfway. And then descending through and into the valley. Okay. Sticking to half throttle. Follow this road around to the left here. Yeah, that looks good. Coming down to quarter throttle. Gear out. Full flaps in three, two, one, full flaps. Doing a left turn now towards the runway. Keep it on that quarter throttle for the moment. Brake set. Did you say handbrake set? That is indeed, yeah. So, just sitting, coming up towards the 100 knot mark now. So, just keeping it slow as we go over the top of the hill. Very descent and short landing. Sort of sitting about 120 at the moment. Left or right? Uh, we're going to be doing a left hook onto the runway. So, descending over this part here. Throttle to idle now. Air brake out in three, two, one. Air brake out. Okay. And then coming in low, left hook. And oh yeah! <laughs> Blimey, that was a blinding warm up. Well done. <laughs> I was so tight on that uh, on that loop. That was very very good. I was there was a tight with it. I was right with you all the way through that. That was very good. Nice. <clears throat> Superb. <laughs> That'd be good, Amrock. I'm going to restart and see if I can get rid of this twitching. It was terrible. Right, cool.
Okay, good, good. Um, I went through some of my uh, Sage flight plans. I've got one that uh, Rowdy gave us a little while back. It's a river run under some low bridges, if you're up for that. Yeah, brand new. <coughs> okay. Go for it. Yep. Oh. Um, so if I tell you what I'll do, I will just put it into the chat, the MSFS chip chat so you can uh, download it if you want to so know so did you see that big 10 meter beast i showed the photo off yes oh yeah people do spend serious money on gliders apparently it's about fourteen thousand pound that thing because of all the extras that he's got on it as well has it got a power pod on top it, it, it folds out. It's a single prop with a counterweight. I've seen that, yeah. I've seen one of those. I, I might know this guy. I might know this guy. It's, it's like an Ikea folding arm. Yeah. He's got, he's got a grey... He drives a grey van with a big glider sticker on the side. Yeah, I th OK. So I think he used to fly at Middle Wallet when that was uh, an RC club. Yeah. I'd say the thing is a monster. Yeah. Oh, amazing. Okay, it sorry. was absolutely horrifying watching the ground loop. <laughs> I bet. I've just loaded that, put that flight plan into the chat. So, X team to main menu. Okay. Yeah, some people have got three MBs and I only have two. Yeah, I don't. After I had, did the last up, update of the MB. Yeah, if you if you got it from the um, the store, then you, they've still only got the two. But oh, it's just not it. Okay. Just got the third one. Oh, I see. So we're going for low flight under bridges. Are we still using the MBs? Yeah, I think so. Cool. Uh, so it's New River Gorge, West Virginia. What's the uh, start code? Uh, K C R W. KCRW, runway 23. <clears throat> if you want to put in the destination, it is a KPSK, runway 24. Uh, Tom's asking me, hey Dom, I have a question. How can I get the new helicopter? Uh, it's, well, I need a link for it. EC125. We've got it in our, uh, well, we've got actually got a, um, if you're on the Discord, there's a folder for it. There's a channel for it. Yeah. It should be in there. And it's, yeah, yeah the latest update and everything is in there. Yeah, like, and it's very, very good, I have to say. Uh, while I'm loading up, I'll try and find the link. Uh, 135, sorry. Uh, here we go. I found it copy link go to the chat there you go Tom we'll probably do a heli trip in the not too distant future I didn't notice many differences with the point nine zero upgrade but there must be some there Uh, definitely a lot of hot pictures that have improved my end a lot. Well, 
I did a couple of different things to try and fix all the things that were going on with me, so... Something worked. Our pedals are still twitching. I'm wondering what they're. Oh, maybe it's a hard way. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Maybe you need to calibrate your uh, your joystick. Yeah. Try that. Quick gun is everyone on? Uh, One, two, three. Twenty three. Yeah, twenty three. I'm looking at the numbers on the floor. <laughs> I can see a few people appearing. Have others loaded here. the flight plan? I don't do organisation like the flight plans. Yeah. All right. So uh, this is a, a long runway. So let's do a, a taxi-style takeoff. So I'm going to third throttle. You flaps up for this. Flaps down now. Rolling. Everybody rolling? Looks that way. All right. Uh, full power in three, two, one, full power. I've just got names but no flames at the moment. Yeah, me too. It's gone back to that. Rotating. Pull back. Ah, uh, decent. Pull me away from the formation. <laughs> Flap. Flaps up. We are going to be rolling left. In three, two, one, roll left. You'll see the river. First bridge, one about a kilometre away. Super low. Tight, 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 tight. Under. I think I'll be able to go under bridges the way I'm twitching here. Yeah. I went under with a bit of a thump, I have to say. I went clean that time. Yeah, I was clean. That's because you're just a name tag. Round the bend <laughs> and another one. Alright, don't just vanish for me. Whoa, yeah. I don't know if that was decent. No, you just in front now, I'm on your right wing. Yeah, it was. It was just decent. Yeah, cool. Twenty feet and left. We've got water hills. No surprise. That's nice. Running at about 210. Oh, that's low. 
The rudder just does not turn the plane. I can't flat turn. Oh, there's a house. <laughs> you know when you're low when you look up at the first floor. Skimming, Jason. Oh, oh my God! Thank God the water's flat. Oh, this is good. Skin. Also, that to fly an idle to uh, keep a pilot uh, two thirds. If that's what you're asking, so your volume's a little bit low. Better now? Yeah, that's better. Yeah, I just said that the Alpha has to fly on idle to uh, that's it. catch speed. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty quick, the Alpha. Oh, bridge! Ah. Whoa! I overtook you at the same time. <laughs> Lovely. This is a this is a good one. Judging altitude by the shadow. Oh, that's a touch! Oh, oh my god, bridge! 
No, I can't make that. <laughs> I can't push that hard enough and not hit the wall. Oh, oh. This is brilliant because it kind of forces the altitude and we're so much closer together because of that. Hit the deck. We're going round to the right. Not squirrels this time, it's oh. fish. Oh. <laughs> like we're going... Has there ever been a recorded flame out due to fish? <laughs> It'd be like sushi. Can we keep it low? Whoa, hard left turn. Oh yeah, big left. Oh, too big, too big. Ah! <laughs> Okay, fish and squirrels for me. <laughs> I'm glad it's you like went first, I anticipated that perfectly. Bridge coming up. You're way ahead, Paul. Yeah, no, I, I've give got us, weird give stuff us, happening. Give us the warnings. <laughs> no, I just ended up in the water. Bridge. Come on, come on. Woohoo! Left turn followed by a hard right. Ooh, cool lagoon. This waterfall. Whoa, very hard right. No, oh, I'm not gonna make it. See planes again. Woo! Welcome back. Oh, this is exhausting. This one straight after it. Oh, there is. Oh. oh! Oh, I clipped something. Yeah, they didn't like me going under that one. I hit something beforehand. Oh, oh no. The low bridge is. Oh, no. oh. oh Big bridge. Can't do it. something before I hit that second bridge. Yeah, it was the first bridge. It had that invisible barrier underneath it. Oh. I hit it as well. I just managed to just about recover. Waypoint 19.
Oh, which way? I see. Yeah. Right, right, right. I just went in and swapped out the control for my rudder because it was just so bad. Is that right now? Yeah, yeah, that was nothing. Although it's weird because it's a very muted color. I had this happen before. Let's skip that. Oh, oh, squirrels. Ah, come on. God, that's close. Bridge. Bridge support. No. Oh. oh, I hit the bridge support. I'm up. <coughs> They like their low bridges around here. <laughs> Makes it insane. It does. I still don't understand why they wouldn't design them to have jet fl planes flying under them all the time. <laughs> it's very inconsiderate. It is. Oh, I went the wrong way. So for anyone who didn't know, we've just done a 90 degree left instead of the right turn. <laughs> Wait for Coming turn. round. Whoops. That's strange. Now we're hunting squirrels. Forming up on you now. Okay. Oh, I'd be sick. Damn it. Yeah, so I think... Oh, it's getting all confused. On the waypoints. I think we'll land at WV59. Okay, okay. Bearing is 33. Turn right back, back, back. Full flex. Can't see the runway. It's just there in between the trees. To your right. Turning in now. Oh. Brake set. It's a short field. Brake set. Trying to touch up numbers. Arrows. Oh. You know. Down. That was short. Right? Okay, I'm going to run out of runway. EDF skid. Oh, just on the parking at the, the uh, turn point on the end. <laughs> yeah, that is short. <laughs> that was good. We'll have to do that again sometime. Yeah, I won't bad at all. <laughs> I did pretty well considering I couldn't steer once I was on the ground. Nah. 
Don't need to worry about what happens on the ground. Brain Noir just in. Oh Lord Zico coming down. Followed by Alan. Sala Mokes. Oh. Alan ain't stopping. Bye. <laughs> I'm in the lake. The fish. <laughs> Alan! Alan! Can land a helicopter. <laughs> the Alpha Jet was stuck doing donuts. Okay, good stuff. Oh, oh, oh. Juicy's gone for two landings, three landings, four landings. Bye bye. Towing his brake <laughs> chute behind him. How did he not slow down? I think by the fourth landing, it was too late. That's a problem. You can't slow down when you're in the air. Uh, looking quick. He's attempted to use an arrest the tree, but realised they're invisible. <laughs> All right, good stuff. Who wants to lead a trip then? Anybody got one up their sleeve? Um, Don't say the Everest run. That's the only one I know off the top of my head. <laughs> I've got a short one if you want one. It's something completely different we haven't done before. Sounds good. I like new. I, uh, I thought Monty Python was about to pop out for a second then. What, sure? Now, completely different. I and now for something completely different. <laughs> so this this is larking at a runway at an airport which has towers and bridges and all sorts of stuff. It's only 10 minutes, I suppose. You want the pit special and oh. you want to go to Tokyo Haneda, which is RJTT. RJTT. And the pits. And runway number? Runway 16. 16 left. Uh, one six right, I think it is. One six right, okay. RJTT. It and won't matter too much. Pit special, you reckon? Definitely the pits. Was it RG, so Romeo Golf, or something else? RJTT. Runway oh. one six. So a bit of a warning, there's uh, lots of things to fly around, control towers in and amongst the buildings, uh, several bridges <clears throat> and structures you can fly under, and several that you can't, you'll find out. Well, we'll follow you, promising. we'll follow you, Alan. I'll, I'll lead off anyway when we eventually get there. Okay. Original. Hopefully not too, too many uh, Japanese professional pilots will be there to get annoyed that we swarm them. In their zeros. <laughs> Let's hope not. And uh, the runway we're taking? Oh, uh, one six is right. Oh, one six. Oh, shoot. Oh. Samson video said still major stutters. Uh, so I'm not getting anything. I'm not getting a physical thing. I don't know if that's just the screen. And I've incompetently formated on the wrong runway. Yeah, I think I'm with you at 23. I'm going to take... I'm on 2-3. I'm going to take off and join you guys. So you tell us which runway to pick, and then you go on the wrong one. That's a good start to the lead. 
<laughs> I, I like to start as I mean to continue, really. Just get airborne from where you are and head towards the control towers. Right here. And then you can formate on me. I was glitchy on the last run, but not too bad on this one. I'm terrible on this one. Ooh, every second. Yeah, this is not looking good for me. Yeah, yeah it's, it's got quite the load in. Oh yeah, I've got the, uh, I'm getting the frame drop. Oh, it's alright, it's alright. Yeah, I have the two second uh, stutter too. I did have it and now it's gone. I see a central oh. RC taking off. Yeah, mine just right jumped out too. I'm right in front of you, so if you follow me. Oh, that's come back again. Yeah, me too. Yeah, I'm still getting my one frame forward, one frame still. Yeah. Well, we're cool. just orbiting the uh, main control tower, and then once everyone's ready, we'll start diving through a few uh, bridges and things. Not sure I'll be able to the way this is working. Yeah, yeah it's not looking great. I'm gonna test something to try with a different plane if it uh, still exists. That way. The extra might be worth doing. It could be that Tokyo is a photogrammetry city and it's trying to load up all the photogrammetry or something. Yeah, it did have a big update a long time ago, but it, we, it never used to have the issues. Mm. Only recently now we get all these performance issues. Well, I can see a few of you flying around the, the tower. Yeah, it's we're like, flying, but uh, about three frames a minute. It's like King Kong. All we need to do in this round, the Empire State <laughs> Building. <laughs> Well, if it's not going to work, uh, Dom, do you want to call it a day here and try somewhere else? Yeah. Yeah, it's unflyable for me, unfortunately. I'd really like to do it, but it's... It's clearing up again for me. Briefly, two seconds and it's back. I'm just crashing into the floor at the moment. Well, I suggest no, then we go, we go yeah. somewhere else and uh, save this for another day. Yeah. Well, I've got one on the west coast of uh, Canada, if you're interested in that one. Yeah. I can exit. Hey, hang on a second. He's going to take anything because he's, he's worried about doing the Everest run. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Quite oh, weirdly, though, I had a lot of splattering on the last run, but oh, I'm crystal go. clear here. No, I'm, I'm definitely having I've gone back to the main menu. Yes, have I? Yep. I'll join you there. We'll wait for you to let us know the start. Yeah, I'll load, it. load up the flight plan. I've already posted it, but I'll do it again in chit-chat. Do you know what the um, start airfield is by any chance? Mm, it's two seconds. And back to the MB or something like that. Warburg. Yes. Oh, okay. Jets. Okay. Uh, Powell River, CYPW, runway 27. CYPW. Yep. And sorry, runway 27. Yep. Just posted the flight plan and chit chat if you want to open that up. It's what I got in here at the moment. So I've got the G91. Uh, well, I did have issues with that last time. Is that Power River? G45. Yes, it is. The MIG. Alpha Jet. You know, I think the MIG could be fun for this. 
Canada West Coast. I'm going to go MIG. I've gone for a TBM 930 for a bit of a change. A what? I, I, I thought I tried to blow the prop. Oh. That is quite a nice aircraft to fly, actually, for some of the small landing strips in the Himalayas and things. Which one is that? TBM 930 or 390. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I like that plane a lot. It's amazing because even though we're on the same server, different parts of the world seem to have different performance rates. I think even different users have different performance rates. Yeah, you think it was just server that was the common denominator, but I don't know. So what resolution, resolution are we all running at the moment? 1080. All of it. Ten eighty. I'm still getting what is there. I think I'm on nineteen twenty or whatever it is. Twenty seven. By the way. way by the way, five miles, your landing challenge at last select one point six million is amazing. I can't see any of us beating that. Wow, that's <laughs> impressive. Wait, what's this? The landing challenge at La Select, which I suggested we all have a go at, I managed 1.2 million, and Five yeah. Miles, about a month ago, did 1.6 million. Well, maybe we should do a run of that and see, as we've all hit around, see who does the best of that in a minute. That'd be something Absolutely. to try. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The only thing is, you can't do it as a group, you have to do it individually. You yeah, won't it does it individually, other. but we can call out our scores, can't we? <laughs> yeah, squirrels! <laughs> Lots of lions, right? Well, yeah, two million! Yeah, you can screenshot as well if need be. You mean if lying is suspected? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Very good. It's like QC Frank again. Yep. Uh, Disappearing uh, lying yep. is mandatory. Disappearing off into the trees. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's, he's gone for the conversation. <laughs> you see, what, it's, it's, it's very efficient, you see, because the intake, as it goes through the jet, mulches the tree, and then the drag chute picks all up all the bits. That guy goes nowhere slowly. It's <laughs> off again! <laughs> There's Four boards, marks out of ten. For me, it's a bonanza. Wow. What he's flying... Uh... Yeah, it's a Bonanza or Cherokee for me as well. Yeah. He's flying a G91. Right, we're ready. These yeah, I think so. Oh, a nice mig. Okay. Oh, Nicole. So... Uh, I can't uh, see the name tag. Whoever's flying the red and white MB, your air brake is down. Well, it's up now. Uh, if you in a mig, you, your air brake was down. You got it up now? Yeah, you're good. Yeah, left it down after the last landing. Just checking. Okay. Going to full throttle in... Uh, well, go full throttle with brakes on. And brakes off in 3, 2, 1. We'll go release. Rotate, gear up, damn it, I'm a rudder. <laughs> There's a pit. <laughs> Siri, where are you going? <laughs> I'm trying to find you. We're behind you. I've got you. It's 
sorry, I disable my rudder. I don't know where we're going, okay. I'm just back so to get grab. We're going to go right into an inlet just up ahead here. In fact, actually where you guys are now. Renoir's got the right idea. It's always smooth in Canada, isn't it? Yeah, nobody flies around here. Well, you've got plenty of space. So would you work a lot? I'm at half throttle, let you guys catch up. Tom, your flaps are down. Mm. Oh, no, they're not. No, it was just the way the light was on your tail for me for a minute. Oh, don't make that mistake anymore. I can always hear you in my ear. <laughs> Even when you're not flying with us, I can hear you. <laughs> oh, you did slow down, Paul. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that. There was an anchor on that one. Okay, continuing going to the left of the mountain in front of us. Airbrake still to avoid that. 70%. Right turn. Dom, your air brakes out. Best be buzzed by a MiG. <laughs> Is that good to fly? It's not bad, it's actually it's a very good model. Yeah, it I like the MiG. Left turn coming up. Nice pictures on the beach this morning, Simon. Yeah, it was good morning. Enjoyed it. Good gym. Very nice. Very windy. I'm in the end of all your turbines. <laughs> I don't get to time very often. That's what about that Mephisto? That was amazing. Oh, God, yeah. He so nearly got over that hedge. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it looked like it's almost not worth repairing. No, no, he's all the new airframe. He said he was going to phone up his wife and say if he could ask if he could spend another five grand. <laughs> oh, jeez. He's a brave man. <laughs> yeah, he is that. Yeah, he's got that much money to throw away. Did he sleep in the car, does he now? 
I tell you what, that's probably one of his cheaper jets. He's got a, which he hasn't flown yet, a Skymaster SU-27. So that's a twin turbine. It's huge. Is this, the, is this the guy you were speaking to with the really amazing, expensive jets and really bad Wi-Fi? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Priorities, eh? Yeah, he spends all his money on his hobby and not on his Wi-Fi. So how much are we talking for that uh, twin jet? I think it's, well, uh, probably 20, low 20s. What, 20 quid? <laughs> I'll give him 20 quid for it. Yeah, we're always talking thousands when it comes to turbine jets. I don't think I could enjoy flying something that was that expensive. <laughs> I'm not sure he will. I'd be terrified. I just spent 50 quid on one of those little e cheen slash Volantex Mustangs that uh, you reviewed the, the week, Dom. The, which one, sorry? The little Mustang, uh, the tiny one. Oh, the, yeah, yeah, e cheen yeah, yeah. They are fantastic for what they are, yeah. Yeah, it looks like it should be fun, yeah. Yeah, so fly on mid mode. Um, okay. Don't, whatever you do, don't put it well. If you're going to put it on expert mode, do it high. It's so twitchy. Right. But it's very okay. good on mid mode. Yeah. I'll give it a go stronger, probably. Yeah, let me know how you get on. Roger. Roger! Don't start that again. <laughs> Roger. <laughs> Roger. <coughs> I have been telling them for a long time, Jake, to do a Spitfire. If they did a Spitfire and it was exactly the same, they would, they would sell loads of them. Yeah, they clean up. They Easy. Would. So yeah, done a yeah. Yeah, it's a lot of world, it's more Spitfires. <laughs> the Corsair would suit uh, Paul Papadelta Brown, would be a good first plane for him. Have you ever flown RC, Paul? I have, but not, not much. I'm just electric. Oh yeah, well, most of us fly electric. Most of what? What? The, what? <coughs> I have anybody who's got any sense. <laughs> yeah, really. Uh, I remember my brother just retired as an Air Canada pilot, and he used to fly RC. My dad would take him out when we were kids, and we'd spend the entire time just trying to get the bloody engine to oh, start I know. up. That's why I gave up nitro engines. Yeah. Just yeah. Apparently, this thing flat spins. We're gonna go right here. Uh, whoops, sorry, no left. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say, I'm the other right. right. Yeah, cheers. No, I, uh, I bought a few kits. I haven't joined up a club, and I, I'm thinking. Probably this summer I should try to do that. Let me start that again. Right up over the hill here, but slightly to the right. Jason, you're off to the left there. I was spinning. I saw that. I'm crashing. Oh no. Rob's asking if any jitters. Yes, Rob, we. Where did we go? We went to Tokyo. 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 Stay away from cities. Stay away from cities, basically. Photogrammetry is bad, man. I'm still... No. Are you still getting it? Yes. Hmm. Yeah, I've got it bad here as well. Yeah, I'm getting it all Left here into the valley. Now, I found with a MiG, if you slow down and just do a load of barrel rolls in one go, it just kind of falls into a flat spin. Oh, lovely. I always know if Doobie's behind me, I'm going too fast.
left turn ahead of us. This is the uh, west coast north of Vancouver. We're going to be a left or right turn on the next one. Left. left. Right again? Oh left no, left sorry. Here. That left and then we bear right gradually. <laughs> Follow the river to the right here, and then it will go left shortly. Roger. Oh, look who's with us. Huh. We only had to say one word. Huh. Rob, how are you? I'm good, thank you. I'm a bit, a bit disappointed I didn't manage to get flying today. No, but you're not. Are you going tomorrow? Uh, well, <laughs> probably not because Sundays is electric only and my electric plane's boring. Oh, is it? At your club? Um, Probably going yeah. sleeping again tomorrow. Hey Rob, any good with a fiberglass repair? Yeah. Fancy repairing a glider? It looked pretty broken, to be honest, Jason. It, it does look pretty broken, yeah. How bad? Uh, I can get some better photos for you. Yeah. I mean, it or unless you want to come sleeping tomorrow, and I can show you. I probably won't get a pass for that, unfortunately. Is that like a wife pass? Exactly that. Flat speed! What the hell is it doing now? Yeah. Oh. oh I've got an update. How am I? Yeah, it's only 120 it's miles a again. It, it fixes many things. Cool. Just don't fly near a city. <laughs> Where are we flying? Well, uh, it found some trees at the moment. We're just debating whether we're killing fish or squirrels. Cool. <laughs> Plant some trees. Squirrels! It's where oh, they get all the syrup from. So have we already discussed that really expensive jet that you crashed, uh, that someone crashed on? Uh, my friend Steve crashed. Uh, yeah, that was a couple of weeks ago. Yes, I, I was saying it's one of his cheaper jets. <laughs> right. <laughs> Is he just going to throw the airframe of that out as well then? I think he's... Well, you certainly rip the nose off it, but keep the rest for spares. Yeah, yeah so the left wing looked like it took a good hit, but in the slow-mo, you can see it was damaged from the trees. I know. If he'd come through that level, he might have made it. It was so close. <laughs> it was so, so close. <laughs> yeah, I need a, um, a modification doing as well, Rob, because there's a couple of things that I don't like. Well, and I'd like to have changed. Sounds very expensive. Well, you, you let me know, but it's only <laughs> from moving the one single servo that moves the ailerons from the centre of the plane to two servos in the wing. Is it all fiberglass? Uh, the accused variety of fiberglass, the wings are a bolster core, a bolster laminate with a foam core. Okay. Um, but obviously, to put a servo in, I imagine you need to put some sort of structural reinforcement around that point because you cut into the wing. Depends on... Well, yeah, it's probably quite a thin cord and a uh, thin profile. It gets, it gets thin towards the ailerons. But it'd be a shame to lose it. It doesn't look that bad. Certainly the floor lost more than the glider did. Um, I'd have to do something about a canopy because... Um, Going got right that here, one. guys. This could just be a complete coincidence, but for anybody else having stutters, I went into data settings and turned off photogrammetry uh, setting, and they're gone now. Oh. Need to climb a high to get full thrust to get up this hill. Thanks for that tip. Or you could just have a MIG and just fly up the hill. You can do that. <laughs> Hi, Papa. All right. Hi, Dad. Hi, Dad.
We're going for that little gap there. Yep. Do it. And then I don't know where the speedo is. Valley. Reach your run. Oh, really very slow place here. Good shot. Oh, I skimmed it. <laughs> Are there plans for a helicopter trip this evening? We do no. that next. I think that'd be a good. I think we should do yeah. <laughs> Helicopters in the storm condition. Jason, you're uninvited, by the way. Oh, okay, I see. Going left. Hey, what can you do that? Uh, I'd invite Jason. Yeah, I just did. Good man. Yeah, left up this hill here. Yeah, that, to be fair, Rob, the main bit that broke is just the um, the nose snapped off, and then um, the body which holds the servos for the ailerons and flat. But obviously, I don't know if there's any other structural issues. I, I need to go over it. The wing isn't that bad, the one that took a hit, but it feels a little bit spongy, so I'm assuming that it probably killed the laminate, but I'm not entirely sure. Mm -hmm. It'd be a shame to lose it. Have I lost Left audio? Turn oh, you here. Rob was just ignoring me. Sorry, I'm just fighting the G-force descending from 30,000 feet. Oh, I see. Left. 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 Roger. 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 I think Manuel will be saying, stupid boy. Goes along with the uh, the river dipping before we could have been chatting. Pike, <laughs> where? Don't tell him, Pike. Oh, stop! Nice man. Uh, they they pop back early, uh, for us a little for a minute and then went away. Um, otherwise, turn your photo photo jump off. Well, the man's a genius because I've just done that. It took ages for it to do it, but it now looks pretty damn good and I'm smooth as anything. Mm. I'll give it a go. It's only one of the main features of the sim, isn't it? <laughs> it? It does lose a lot. Oh, it still looks pretty nice around here. I wouldn't, wouldn't say Paris would look the same or London, but if it's flyable, that's got to be a bonus. Yeah, Tokyo yeah, yeah. might work again. I'm not really having any losses or anything, but if it makes it all that much smoother, then that'll be it for now. Yeah, it might be worth doing it, only turning it on when you're going to one of the cities. Oh, yeah. Well, uh, the, the problem is, is that you turn it off on inner city, and that's where you have the issue. I think it's just trying to narrow it in the bell, isn't it? That's completely solved it for me here, though, so that's good. I searched it up and another apparent solution uh, was that if you, you can turn photogrammetry on but and uh, turn on V-Sync as well in graphic settings. Okay, that's good. To be fair, that is that is running smoother for me as well. Does that mean now this still works? Let's see if this works now. Yeah, no. We've got an issue there. It's fine. Left down to the lake here. It's a fast Cherokee you're flying there, Jason. 
It's a um, MiG-17. Or 15, whichever one it is. Oh no, my stutters are back. So, for me, it's not photogrammetry related. Yeah. Try that V-Sync, try engaging your V-Sync, see if it does it. V-Sync, did you say? Is that in graphics or data? Ah. Uh, or in graphics there is. Yeah. I read that uh, in group flights, if someone is flying with uh, the same plane but with the livery you don't own, it could uh, give some stuff to two, but I didn't test it already. Most, most of the time, they're just turning you into a Cherokee. But if, if someone is flying also an MD and he ha has a livery, no. and you don't own that livery, it could cause some stuff. Well, I've got all the MB liveries. I'll probably do some updates. It's a bit of a mystery though, because we were flying in uh, Venice and that's photogrammetry and it was smooth as anything, wasn't it? Because nobody likes Venice. <laughs> <laughs> it's got a leak. <laughs> Pull the plug. Alright, people with VC off now, it's doing it. Yeah, there's no consistency, is there, at the end of the day? Mm. That's a bit frustrating. I, say, I don't know why it's different, like, for me, it's smooth now. I don't know what's changed. Yeah, I've been smooth all along in this point. Then some hey, Rob. thought it was uh, the window, yes. window patch that caused it, so... Uh, <laughs> So, you, you know how you were interested in that glider that I found? Yeah. Well, I'll sort you out of that as well if you can fix this other one. <laughs> well, sounds like a good deal. Well, what, is, it, is, it, I'll, I'll, is it utter rubbish? Is that why? What, the Ken 21? No, the, one of the wheels is absolutely naff. Um, but apart from that, it's not too bad. It's, it's a little bit taddy, and the previous owner glued the spar into the plane. Because, you know, that's what you do. <laughs> I've heard of worse. I've heard of people gluing servos into very expensive planes. <laughs> Servo gluing, I have seen, right? I could accept somebody gluing in the servos. Gluing the spar into the fuselage, I can't accept. Even if you glued one, one side of the spar into a wing so you never lose it or something, I get it. But not into the fuselage where it sticks out either side. <laughs> Oh, sure, yeah. Yeah, yeah no, Rob, it's, it's not that bad. I've flown it on flat and I've flown it out the slope. Nice. Um, just want what I'm not going to be flying is this much longer if it carries on like this. Yeah. I'm only going to do a short one today because I have some bits that I need to do. Yeah, I'm going to just do the heli after this and then I'll... Uh, Freaking yum! Hey, Warlord. Warlord, let's have a race. This feels faster than Miggle the Alpha. All right. Uh oh, I think I've just run out of fuel. Uh oh, uh -oh. yeah, that was a danger. Alt F to everybody else. Wait, one or... uh, where, where are you? Where are you? Um, in the middle of the lake, flying to the waypoint. Okay, yeah, I'm just... Uh, all right, okay, I'm going high. Please start. Please. I've just gone vertical. I'm just trying to see if I can see you. There you are. Yeah, okay. All right, we'll form up and then we'll do a, a countdown on throttle. I'm just going to put Ebrix on the mat and come down to you. I'm putting my money on the Alpha. If the Alpha does have the, some weird uh, throttle problem, then it should be all right. Sometimes had some flame out uh, problems. What the hell was that giant spike to our left? Let's see it. Okay, we are going to be going right. A little bit of All right, Warlord, I am on your six. Circle around for the one way. Pull the bottle up and go for it. Count for it? Yeah, just do a countdown and then as soon as you say go, I'll hit full beam. All right, three, two, one, give it a go. Go. 
Yep. Yeah. Okay, right turn here, guys. Right turn. Yeah, the make it faster. Dude, what did you get up to today? Drag racing jets. <laughs> <laughs> I think you went through this little valley here, did you? Yes. We got it, and we're going to go left just at the top of that, follow the river around. And we'll be coming up on the runway fairly shortly. We've got uh, three more waypoints to go. And we're short. Is it just me, or this water's colour is not right? No, it's the one. Dark. Yeah. Oh. Mine's like a pale green colour, it's weird. Yeah, same. Yeah. Yeah, it's got that sort of right? like a darky colour, but yeah, to be honest, it's, it's not uncommon for stuff like that, and if the imaging was taken during an algae bloom, then it will be. Oh, you just have beautiful Ooh, very good. Right, where are we going here? Okay, we are going to go leftish. Ish, okay. I went left ish. Okay, <laughs> and then there's going to be a hard left. Yeah, hard left coming up. Up the river there? Yep. That's and not a hard left. It's like 400 meters wide. True. Uh, let me just get my bearings here. No, we've got a left. We've got a left around this hill. I'm going, to, uh, I'm going to turn back and get on your tail. Okay, so left into this little channel, and we're going to go to half throttle, speed brake on. And... Uh, Hello, you're cheating. What are you doing all the way up there? Gear down. Just looking for the airfield. Are we going to Stewart Island airstrip? Yes. Finals! Down. Better where the speedo is in this thing. You're going to want brakes on because it's short and it's got water at both ends. Okay. Fish. I think even if you found the speedo in that, it probably wouldn't work. Most of the gauges work. I think it's on the left-hand side somewhere, in kilometres. Oh, uh, if it's that one, then it doesn't work. It looks like it's probably that one that doesn't work. The one that doesn't work is the damn speedo. Why not? What's the orientation of that airstrip? It is basically headed west-ish. Right, okay. Oh, sorry, east, I mean. Well, I'm either going to make it all stall because I have no idea what my airspeed is. The indicator works for me when I was using the MIG. Mm, you might need an update there. I haven't updated it for a while. Yeah. And touchdown. Good trip, nice. Paul. Thank you. My pleasure. Nice to
Right, well, I think that's going to be it for me today, guys. Always fun. Mm-hmm. Definitely. Jason. Good luck sleeping tomorrow. Yeah, well, that should be good. It's a Mercury break is, anything. Um, Oh, well, I say, you know, it was just unfortunate, but that's one of the modifications that I need to talk to you about because I don't like the way it was. I actually had a fear it was going to do exactly what it did. And the main thing is changing it from twin spars to one spar. Well, I say we'll, we'll go over the bits and see if, see if what I'm after is physically doable or not. <clears throat> but it is a beautiful plane. I've got to work out something about a new canopy. You know, I will have another look tomorrow, but... God knows where it went. I think it possibly was ejected once the wing folded. So as it's 30 mile an hour winds, that could have gone a long way. Pretty good using a Coke bottle. That works quite well. Yeah, but it's like a, a built up around the base. I'm not entirely sure. I think you can still get a... Um, uh, Pat Tickle gliders have just started coming back into production. And I think I can actually get a canopy set for it. Um, I will look into it. Uh, but like I say, I will have a good look tomorrow and see if I can actually see it or not. Um, but yeah. But apart from that, guys, thank you very much. All right. And catch you later. See you, see you, see you later. All yeah, right, no, cheers. cheers. Heli trip. Roger. Roger, Roger. Where to? Where's Bet? Where's good for helis? That doesn't have photogrammetry. <laughs> really? I think that'll be it for me if you're off into the helicopters. I've not got it downloaded, so I'll leave you, leave you to it. All right, <laughs> Spot on. Have see a good one. Cheers. See ya. Night. Should we just pick a random? Dubai? Yeah, just pick somewhere random. Dubai? OMDB, OMDB, Dubai? So you can get to the top of the Burj Khalif first. Ooh. Sorry, where did you say it was? OMDB. Thanks. Shall we go runway 12 left? Oh, I was doing a cold start. Let's all go for a, a parking ramp. Same one. <laughs> <laughs> I picked the first one on the list, I think. Yeah, I did too. I'm just sitting on the main runway, annoying the pros. <laughs> oh, is it busy? Even better. Uh, not too bad, actually. Okay. I'm flying at night, so don't blame me if I crash into you. Oh, are you? <clears throat> 30 cents. That's a 12 midday, yeah? Yeah. 50 cents.
the glitches back. Same here. Not too high then. Yeah, I have the two second glitch uh, stutter also. And main menu. God. So I've wound all my graphic settings down to low. Yeah. And it's still running at 10 frames a second. Yeah, it's not that then. I'm getting good frames per second, but it is, uh, it's pausing and you can see it on all the, uh, all the performance stats. It just drops everything. Yeah, that's right, yeah. Uh, I I think it's conspiring against multiplayers. Yeah, probably. I think it's server-related uh, uh, something. It's got, yeah, definitely to do with the server. Do you think switching servers would make a difference? I was just going to have a look. Okay, guys, I give it a go. See you later. Are you off? See hey, ya. Uh, all right, see you, man. See, ya. Yep. see you, buddy. West Europe looks a bit better. So damn slow, though. So I accidentally signed out of the server. <laughs> that wasn't smart. I'm going to go to O'Hare and see if what that's like. K O R D. Yeah. <clears throat> I'll let you know. Which wrong way? Oh, I don't think I picked one actually. The default. There's quite a choice. <laughs> it's a big airport. 28 right, yeah? I didn't consciously select anything, so I suspect so. Nearly there. God. Taking longer than ever to load. Dom, do you change servers or not? No. North Europe. Make this field add on. No, Jamaica, I haven't. Do you want a link? Is that? What is it a link? Oh, God. Yeah, still doing it for me. Yeah. I think they have ruined the game. Maybe Chicago was a bad idea. 
I've oh, changed no, there, no. Brett. I've got your Stuart. Quite, it's quite good for me. I've got his G. I see you, mate. Changing to God, West Europe's terrible. Southeast Asia. How can that be? Sixty-three. Oh no, it's the problem is when you got this glitchy problem, it doesn't let you select from the list. Well, it doesn't me. Oh no, it has now. Resume. I've just jumped to West Europe, I've got no issues. Yeah. Yeah, correct. Good. Same for me. Yeah, try. It might get worse as we all join, but <laughs> So where you where are we going? I'm at KORD at the moment. Yeah, we're yeah, on there as well. Oh, it's behind you. Oh, like Hovering. It's taking off. What do I have to do? To... Scroll uh, the two switches in the center console with a red ring. Scroll your mouse with one. Sorry, what was the airport again? K O R D. K O R D Renoir. Twenty eight, right? Yeah. I'm just joining you there. I had to finish off a quad style dive off the Burj Khalifa first. <laughs> Understandable. Well it had to be. Where are Where's the city from here? Oh no, started again. Yeah, it started. <laughs> oh, oh yep, yep. for everyone at the same time. Exactly the same time. Right. It's gotta be ser it's server related then, isn't it? Absolutely. Nothing yeah. else for it. I don't think they can handle how many there are of us there are at the moment. Right, I'm ditching the helicopter, we're going straight down and I'm rage quitting the game. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think I'm done for this evening. We had a good time while it lasted. What yeah. a shame. 20 yeah. minutes. <laughs> oh, Alright guys, thanks very much. See you soon. Maybe Wednesday. Bye, again. Bye, bye. 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 bye guys. Bye. bye. And Steph, sorry. So thanks to everybody watching on the live stream. Sorry, but again we have this um, performance problem that you can see that we seem to get sometimes where it freezes so uh, we had fun while it lasted for about an hour and a half but we'll try again on Wednesday thanks for tuning in and watching on Essential RC really appreciate it it's good fun when it works just a shame that it doesn't sometimes Enjoy the rest of your weekend. If you aren't subscribed, then click on that subscribe button and click the bell icon for notifications. We're, I'm uploading video reviews and just action, RC action on an almost daily basis. But uh, otherwise, take care. See you soon.